Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Ashley P. Dick, and today I'll be teaming up with Harella Hair to bring you this beautiful curly lace wig install. So you guys know I'm all about a good bust down middle part closure wig. That is my favorite wig to install, just more so because of the easy maintenance, the carefree being able to like take it off at night and throw it back on like I had in the morning. But when I want to get glam and just be cute and fine, of course, we love a good frontal. We love a good sideburn moment. We love, you know, just everything that comes with the frontal, being able to put it up into ponytails and buns and just show off the lace ear to ear. So today's going to be super fun. I'm going to be showing you how to install your wigs as like a ponytail or a top knot or a bun, whatever you want to call it without using a 360 lace wig. So as I mentioned, this is a 13 by 4 lace front wig. You have the lace from ear to ear, but you don't have like that frontal 360 frontal lace in the back so I'm going to show you how to finesse it and camouflage it because I love 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 to do a little good curly wig with a little few curly pieces down in a top knot bun so I'm going to be showing you that but first we're going to start with the install and without further ado let's go ahead and jump right into it today I'm going to be doing a install and I'm going to try something different and do a talk through um not different like I've never done it before but just different in that it's always like I just turn the camera on and just film but I'm going to go through the step by step with you guys without talking too much or oversharing let's hope so we are doing a front so I went ahead and cut off the excess lace in the back I'm also going to go ahead and hook these straps in the back at the nape up now these are important to me because have you ever like had your wig installed and these come unhooked and you can feel your wig just sitting there I feel like these hooks even if they're subtle it helps the wig to like clothes or a hug at the nape of your neck where like the small of your neck um this one also did come with the strap here now this one is adjustable and it's removable typically i would take it out but for today i'm just gonna go ahead and leave it in lately i have been working out doing um, pilates and boxing and it is a little bit kicking my butt but i'm just trying to create the habits that um will help me to you know live a happy healthier more in shape life and also more importantly teaching my children through example of the way they should live so this is the wig here and as you guys can see we're going like short and curly which should be super fun i typically go long and curly or like if i'm short it's like a bang so i do like to switch it up all of the exact details and a direct link to this wig are in the description box. But this is what the hairline looks like. The hairline probably is my favorite part so far. Just because it's pre-plucked nicely. Now, the knots are not bleached. First of all, let me cut some of this lace off. So it appears that the knots are bleached along the hairline. The hairline looks absolutely beautiful. Let's see what the parting looks like. <laughs> And this is what it looks like as a center part. And this is kind of the idea of what you would get as a side part. And then you can also do like the flip over or the comb over, however you want to call it, and do no parting at all. And this is what she looks like from the back. You already know with curly hair, the shrinkage is real. So she appears to be like a short curly wig, but she actually goes below the boob. A little bit longer than my natural hair. Of course, fuller and different texture. Process. We're gonna just pull all the hair back, cut off the lace, bond her down. And then I ran out of, you guys know this is what I've been using. There's literally, I when I run out of stuff typically and I throw it away, there's a little bit left. This is the first time I've ran out of something and it's completely empty. So this is what we're gonna be using to install. I have it in the description box and it's a spritz. It's a super hold spritz.
okay so but wig is bonded down and this is what she looks like this side I did a better job you can see it's nice and clean on this side you can see a little bit of the residue very easy fix you just take alcohol and I like to personally keep um, alcohol in a spray bottle like with my hair stuff now typically this step for me really isn't necessary because I'm gonna do baby hair so by the time I do baby hair and you know at the powder to the parting and all that like it usually naturally takes care of itself naturally but for the sake of the video um you just add a little bit to start i'm just thinking about stamping out a middle part first so we can see what it looks like down yeah I don't wanna slow down, I don't wanna slow down, I don't wanna slow down till I burn out. I just wanna live fast, I don't wanna look back and say I could've done more than I did not. Sometimes it can be hard, yeah, it can be hard, yeah, it can be hard when you grow up. People fill you with doubt, you start thinking about what you're gonna do now. But we, only got one chance and got one life to live. And it's do or die, gotta make it count, so lose your worries. One time out of ten, two times won't you be mine? We just can't pretend. This love thing can take time. Three times then I'm in. I heard through the grapevines. You missing a playtime, girl. Your beauty make them bow down. I need that body right now. you guys can see i started with the mousse but sometimes when i'm looking at my hair i can tell what it needs majority of the time i just go mousse it's easier but with this one i wanted a little bit more definition but not dim and brush definition so i did add the cantu curl cream and this is the results i might go in and brush it with the dim and brush in just a moment so i'm going to make this side match this side we're going to take the milk belt off and decide do we want these little piece bangs or do we not neck bright i get that check right i'm so blessed right off of that jet pipe off of that side i'm in a new cool my nigga i've been fired i said what i said right yeah i get that check right i'm so blessed right off of that jet pipe off of that west side i'm in a new cool my nigga i've been fired Okay, 
guys so we are done with the look absolutely gorgeous and i love it as i did mention this one did come courtesy of harella harella hair and then this is the box aka the packaging inside of the box you did get a little bit of stuff so this is the dust bag if i did not mention already this is a 13 by 4 transparent lace wig in the length 20 inches a good 20 inches but you guys know what curly hair is going to give you shrinkage just like our natural tresses and then inside you got one pack of wig caps here and then you also got a second pack here so they did load me up and then you also got a melt belt right here. Love a good cheetah print moment. Those work great for like my Pilates. And then I got a Kabuki brush for travel as well as a nice pair of lashes. So with this hair, I love the fact that this was a frontal. You guys know I don't do or you cannot do sideburns with a closure wig. So this gave me a pop out moment and I definitely took full advantage. For the curls like in my Pilates outfit, my leggings and my sports bra, it just gives black girl aesthetic. I absolutely love this one. And the icing on the cake is that I was able to give you two styles with this one. So be sure to check out Harella. I have a direct link to this wig in the description box. Also go ahead and follow me if you don't already here on YouTube or we call it subscribe here, right? Subscribe here on YouTube and follow me on Instagram. I'm Ashley be deck everywhere thank you guys so much for watching and as always i'll see you in the next one smooches